Hey all dinosaurs and welcome back to the second episode of the dinosaur vending machine game and today we have lots of other cool toys as well so let's get started. So what I'm gonna do right here is to insert this token into the slot and then we will turn this knob, retrieve the toy and talk about that. Let's do it! Okay, so our very first toy right over here, it's a dinosaur transforming egg. And let's transform this into a dinosaur, shall we? Oh, what is this? This looks pretty cool. Let me open this up. Oh, this looks like a prehistoric animal. And right over here, we have a woolly mammoth. A woolly mammoth is definitely not a dinosaur. Pretty cool. This looks like Manny from the Ice Age. And let's insert our second token into the machine, shall we? Okay. Oh. Another dinosaur egg. And what is this? This looks like the Therizinosaurus, but I feel, um, I mean, if I remember correctly, some of you guys said that this is actually not um, a Therizinosaurus. This could be like a um, city patty, I'm not too sure. Can you guys let me know? This definitely looks like a Therizinosaurus to me. The color combination looks like the one from Schleich. Okay. Pretty nice, let me know in the comments which dinosaur is this, I'm not too sure. Okay, let's move on to our next item. Here's the token, insert it right over here. Oh, there is another one, and what is this? This looks like another prehistoric animal. Okay, let's transform this. Oh, let's get the head out. Oh, this is Arsenoetherium, the prehistoric animal, which looks like a modern-day rhinoceros. Take a look at this creature. It has actually two horns right in front of its snout. Very cool. This figure is actually... Um, I mean, this toy looks like an Ice Age toy as well, but this is definitely an Arsenoetherium. Cool. Let's move on. To our next item, shall we? Oh, seems like it is stock. Just give me one second. Okay, here we go. So, our next toy right over here, we have a surprise ball or a surprise egg. Let's have a look at what's inside. Firstly, we have a mini figure Iron Man favorite Marvel superhero, the Iron Man, and this is from a surprise egg, um, I think, can't really remember, so let's have a look at what's inside this ball, okay, so basically, this round part's inside, so we have a Spinosaurus, so I'm gonna show you guys a Spinosaurus toy, and right over here, we have a figure from Colorado. So we have the Spine Lizard right over here. Take a look at this brilliant sale of the Spinosaurus. Really huge. The Spinosaurus was an aquatic, semi-aquatic dinosaur. Super cool, I love it. One of my most favorite um, carnivorous dinosaur. Okay, the next one, let's see. What do we have over here? We have a Pecky Cephalosaurus. Okay, and I have a 3D puzzle toy of a Pachycephalosaurus right over here. Very cool, I love this herbivorous dinosaur. So basically, this dinosaur actually uses very very hot skull for defense purposes as well as for, you know, territory challenging, you know, challenging other Pachycephalosaurus. That's cool. Let's move on to our next one, our next card, we have a shark. Let me see whether I have a shark toy and right over here seems like we have a figure from Schleich. 
And this is the great white shark. How cool is this? Still has a tag right over here. Great white shark. The shark, the shark week is actually on right now, so you guys can actually catch it on like Animal Planet Discovery. I'm not too sure. So we have a great white shark right over here. One of my favorite marine animals. Okay, let's move on to our next. Can we still turn it? Okay, seems like we have to insert another token. Okay, let's insert it. Oh, cool. We have another surprise ball or a surprise egg. Let's open this up. There's a tape right over there. I'm gonna use some force. Cool, cool, what is this? We have the Conal Taurus right over here. And let's see, what figure do we have? A Conal Taurus figure, and this is from Favorite. The name of this company is known as Favorite. It is a um, dinosaur company from Japan. Very nice figure, I actually like this a lot. So, according to some research, the Conotaurus actually had very slender and long legs and it was a pretty fast dinosaur. Take a look at this. Conotaurus is known as the meat-eating bull. Um, it actually has arms which are shorter than that of a T-Rex. <laughs> okay, the T-Rex already have very short arms and can you imagine that the Conotaurus actually has even shorter arms. Okay, poor thing. Let's move on to the next card. Conotaurus, what's next? Stegosaurus, the roof lizard. Oh my goodness, what do we have? Oh, right over there. We have a Schleich Moto, like a figure, very nice. This is actually a pretty, pretty nice model from Schleich. You know, sometimes Schleich can produce really classic um, herbivorous dinosaurs, but most of the carnivorous dinosaurs, they look too cartoonish to me. So have a look at this. Very brilliant sculpt. I love the posture. Seems like the Stegosaurus is in a defensive stance. Looks brilliant. I love the amazing details. The coloring of this figure is not too exaggerated, so that is very nice. Okay, let's move on to the next card. We have the Triceratops. Three horned face. As you guys can see, it has three horns right in front of its face, which is why it is known as the three horn face. And what Triceratops figure do we have now? We have Another nice model from favorite. So you guys can see the Triceratops, you know, has a big light mouth, which can be used to clip off like you know leaves, little twigs, and you know, other plants. Okay, of course, it is a herbivorous dinosaur. Very nice. One of my most favorite herbivorous dinosaurs of all time. I love this. And this model is from favorite and once again it is very nicely done you can see some nice creases right over here the master definition is incredible the details the paint work flawless okay and let's move on to the next item but before we move on let's have a look at this figure right over here this is a new spider-man figurine from the um Spider-Man Armour Set Dinosaur Homecoming. Okay, from the Spider-Man Homecoming. So basically, what you can do is that you press both legs together, and Spider-Man will raise both his arms, and there is actually lights coming up from the arms. Take a look at this. You know, it's really bright right over here, so you guys can't really see it. So very cool. He wears a backpack as well, not too sure whether that is necessary, but looks very nice. Have you guys seen the movie, Spider-Man Homecoming? Let me know in the comments. And over here, we have a minifigure of Captain America. So which side are you on? Are you on um, Iron Man's side or Captain America's side? I mean, according to Saver War. Okay, let's move on to our next 
insert this token into it enter cool, cool. and not a surprise ball and looks like we have plenty of toys inside this okay first we have a Disney car and this was from the Kinder Surprise Egg I've if I remember correctly so we have Lightning McQueen right over here and Cars 3 is coming out really soon I can't wait for it over here we have oh my goodness I can't remember the name of this um, superhero from Guardians of the Galaxy can you guys let me know I can't remember bad memory okay next we have Donald Duck I mean, from Mickey Mouse obviously and we have this little horse can't remember the name as well from Toy Story and what's next Tyrant Lizard King oh my Tyrant Lizard King figure is actually right over there which I forgotten to bring it over here so I have to pause this video for a second okay I am back with the Tyrannosaurus Rex figure or rather toy this is from Takara Tomi a brand new the latest um, Tyrannosaurus Rex toy from Takara Tomi let's open this up this is actually pretty cool okay it's a mechanical or rather kinetic dinosaur toy okay let's take a look at this so basically it comes with this little trigger right over here and once you press it it'll actually charge up this toy so you guys can see the legs will move the mouth will move the tail will swing sideways as it walk okay I'm gonna show you guys it and just the camera first okay here are the tokens <laughs> have a look at this okay now place him right over here and here he walks really cute how cute is that tyrannosaurus rex that can walk super cool okay let's move on to our next toy let's insert this token oh. Okay, managed to turn it successfully. Oh, not real. Oh, it's right over here. Okay, here we are. Another surprise ball. Open this up. We have a little chimpanzee, and this figure is from Weedman, a brand from Japan. It is actually very cool. Take a look at this. It says Weedman right below. A chimpanzee close relative to a human before we actually move on to the cards I have more animal toys to show you guys I'm gonna show you guys my favorite animal one of my favorite not exactly my most favorite tiger this is probably a Bengal or Siberian tiger not too sure because this is a 3d puzzle toy which means you can actually take it off and assemble it okay very easily kids love this Okay, let's move on to our next item, shall we? Not the next item, it comes inside the surprise ball. We have a raptor right over here, and I'm gonna show you guys a raptor figure, okay? Right over here, we have the latest Velociraptor from Safari Limited, the 2017 model, and I love this. This is actually a feathered raptor. Brilliantly done. The paintwork, the details is absolutely incredible. I love it. Okay, let's move on to the next item, which is Mosasaurus. Where is my Mosasaurus figure? Seems like we do not have a Mosasaurus for now, so I'm gonna show you guys another prehistoric marine reptile. And this is the Plesiosaurus. This is a bootleg model, which means it is an imitation of probably a Papo Plesiosaurus, but still looks pretty cool. Next card, let's move on. We have another shock toy. 
do we have another shark? Yes, we have. Right over here, we have another great white shark. And this is from Safari Limited, the 2016 model, which was like last year. Looks pretty, pretty cool. I like it. Let's move on to our next thing. Okay, let's insert another token. Oh, but right over here, I have a horse figure, which I've yet to show you guys. Let's have a look at this. What type of horse is this? Can you guys let me know? Okay, I actually have has the name right below. Okay, I'm just gonna show you guys very, very quickly. Can you guys see that? So if you guys know the breed of this horse, do let me know, okay? Oops. Oh my goodness, earthquake. Let's turn this. We got it. Cool, what is this? It seems like we have another surprise ball. And what's inside? Three cards. First one is a prehistoric flying reptile. And of course, I have a nice figure of a prehistoric flying reptile. And this is a pteranodon from Bully Land. Okay, right over here, Bully Land. It comes with this little circle, which you can actually insert a string and tie it to your ceiling, or maybe to a shelf or something um, which is high, so that your uh, flying reptile it seems like it is flying, so that is cool. Take a look at the face, very nicely done, I love the wings. Shiny paint, silverish, shiny wings, very nice. Nicely done, and I love the details on this incredible stuff okay what is the next oh where are the cards good okay, they're right over here okay so the first one we have I mean the second one we have it's an apatosaurus and this looks like the apatosaurus from Peppo and we have one right over here okay take a look at this very nice apatosaurus and the apatosaurus is known as um the deceptive lizard okay a huge huge sauropod dinosaur with a very long and powerful neck as well as um tail nice long curly tail i love it okay the next one what is this oh this looks like a ferocious dinosaur. And this is known as the Ceratosaurus. Okay, right over here, the Ceratosaurus is known as the horned lizard. If you take a look close up, it, it has like three horns right in front, right on top of a snout. And um, this is a model from Taro by Batat. Okay, um, wait a minute. Where was my Conotaurus? Okay, this Conotaurus was actually not um, from favorite, I beg your pardon. It is from Terra by Botet, so I beg your pardon, okay? Let's move on to the next toy inside this. Let's rotate it. Seems like we have a dinosaur transforming egg, and let's transform this into a prehistoric egg. Dinosaur. So we have another Pteranodon. This is actually very nice. One of my favorite transforming egg dinosaur toys. So we have a Pteranodon right over here. Nicely done. Let's move on to the next one. This one is hot. I can't remember the name of this dinosaur. No way I can remember this. It has wings. It's definitely not a raptor. It could be a city patty. Um, but I can't remember what was the name of this one. Okay, I can't remember. Many of you guys have already told me, but I can't remember. Let's just call this a prehistoric bird, okay? Green bird. Let me know in the comments by saying the green bird is. You know the name of the dinosaur. 
Okay, next, let's move on. Seems like we have two of three more. Okay, but I'm running out of tokens. Oh, stop. We are stuck. I'm pretty sure that one is stuck. Okay, managed to push it down. Oh, it is here. Whew. This one should be a Styracosaurus. Let's have a look. Let's transform this. We have the head out. Okay, this is actually a Centrosaurus, if I remember correctly. Centrosaurus. It's a Ceratopsian dinosaur. To Centrosaurian dinosaur, okay? Very nice. This is actually one of my favorite as well. Very cool. We need more tokens, and I need to retrieve the tokens right away, right? So give me one second. Okay, I am back with more tokens. Let's slip it in and turn this knob. This machine is actually pretty fun. Oh, it is stuck again. Oops, oops, oops. Got it. <laughs> okay, so let's see what's this. Oh. We have this little toy right over here and what type of toad is this or rather frog? I'm not too sure and this one is from Kyodo. Very nice, I love this, it's like a 3D puzzle, very nicely done. Shiny surface, very nice paint work and very nice details as well, I love it. Um, I do not know the species of this frog, okay, so let's have a look at what's the here, it over here. Wow, looks like we have a couple of our cards. First one, we have a woolly mammoth. Another woolly mammoth. Yep, I have a woolly mammoth. 3D puzzle, and how cool is this? You can actually remove the head and piece it right back again. Nice. Okay, the next one, let's see. The plesiosaurus, which we already have seen just now. So we are gonna skip this. Looks like we have another prehistoric flying reptile. And what is this? This is the Schleich Anhungura. Cool. It has an articulated jaw, which you can open and close like this. Very nice details on the tongue and the teeth. Amazing paint, amazing paint work on the wings. And very nice details on the body. I love this. Okay. This is actually like a prehistoric reptile which has like the largest wingspan. So yeah, actually larger wingspan than that of a pteranodon. Let's move on to the next item. Oh, we have a sea creature right over here. And this is the puffer fish. Take a look at this, we have a puffer fish. Puffer fish. 3D puzzle. Okay, this guy is actually very hard to piece and assemble. Okay, it's very hard, so we are not going to dis disassemble it. Okay, so basically, we have a puffer fish right over here. It's very adorable, right? Okay, the next one, let's see. Oh, an orca. The killer whale. And what do we have? We have a nice orca. 3D puzzle as well. This is like one of my most um, earliest toys which I've used in my videos. The Orca. They're very intelligent animals. They are apex predators. They even killed um, some whales and stuff. Okay. Yep. I think we are done. Just left with one more which is right inside. Let's have a look at what dinosaur that is. Cool. Managed to get this guy out successfully and this is the last dinosaur toy inside this vending machine and let's transform this. Um, I think this frill has already given itself away so let's open this up. So over here we have a Styracosaurus. Very cool. I love it. Very nice. Okay. Styracosaurus is known as the spiked lizard. 
Okay. Awesome stuff. Let's take a look at other toys which are not inside a vending machine, which is this Super Marvel and this Marvel superhero figure. And this is not Spider Man, this is actually Kid Arachnoid. Okay. Very nice. I don't know much about this superhero, but I've just read it. It's like another boy which was bitten by another radioactive spider. So yeah, it's a good guy. And of course, oops, we have another superhero right over here. And this is DC Comics Flash. Okay, nice, very nice figure. I love this figure. This will actually look very well when you place it on your desktop. So I think that is all. I've basically I've shown you guys everything except this one right over here, Herrerasaurus, which is known as the Herrera's Lizard. Very nice model from Schleich. You can open and close the mouth, articulate the jaw, the teeth looks weird, but still looks very nice. Amazing details, but the sculpt looks a little bit weird to me. I don't know why. So yep, so that's all for today's video, I hope that you guys enjoy this and if you do, please as usual give this video a thumbs up, share it, leave me a comment and I will definitely reply to you. If you are new here, please hit the subscribe button down below, press the bell icon to receive notifications whenever I upload a video. Thanks for your amazing support and I hope to see you guys tomorrow in the next video. Before you go, as usual, check out the video right over here. And here, subscribe down over here, and here, my second channel. Okay, that's all for today's video. I hope to see you guys tomorrow in the next video. Goodbye.